In this very first video of mine, I will discuss what a real estate marketing plan is and how you can create one. And it's basically one of the most important things you can do before you start any kind of real estate marketing method or campaign. And without it, you basically are flying blindly or you shoot basically blindly on a target. It's like shooting blindly and hoping that for some miraculous reason you will get real estate leads. So what is a real estate marketing plan? It gives you direction and it helps you reach your profit goals. One definition to mention here is that it's basically answering the question what kind of advertising strategy you are going to use to reach your business goals. And there are several very important questions that you need to ask yourself before you start your marketing campaigns. For example, what are your business goals? I already mentioned that. Then what are your results from your market research? What are your what is your ideal target audience and how can you reach how can you best reach them? What is your value proposition? Meaning what benefits are you providing and how are you creating value to your target audience? Your unique selling proposition. How are you different from your competitors? And then of course, which metrics are you going to use to measure the results of your real estate campaigns, of your marketing campaigns? Without measuring this, you won't know what is going wrong or what is going right. And all those questions will result or will inform what marketing activities you're going to do on a weekly, monthly or quarterly basis. So let's make a concreter example, a concrete example. So I'm not speaking of too many theoretical things here. What are your goals? Let's make an example. Let's assume you are a realtor or a real estate agent and you want to make $150,000 in profits per year. This means you will need to make actually more. You will need to make $190,000 in revenue because unfortunately we have to pay taxes. And I assume the corporate tax rate of 21% in the US. So you need to make $190,000 in revenue. Now we can assume that the average home price in the US is $320,000. As a realtor, you usually get 3% commission and this means you would make $9,600 per sale, per house. Now, it depends all on your sales skills. I assume a 10% conversion rate from buyer leads to sales. This is a highly this this highly depends really on your real uh, on your on your sales skills how how good are you giving phone and and all the other things that great people are teaching here also on YouTube one example is Claude Diamond I I recommend you the, his channel and um, well I assume here ten percent okay so by using the ten percent you will need twenty buyer leads per month and by asking all those questions and answering them, hopefully, the, the questions from before, you found out in your market research that your target audience is best reached by Facebook ads. And for Facebook, there are several statistics already out. And the average, for example, the average cost per click on fa for Facebook ads in the real estate industry is $1.81. The average conversion rate is 10.68% for Facebook ads in the real estate industry. Now we can calculate how many, how many clicks you actually need to get those results. 
it's 187 clicks you will need to generate those 20 buyer leads per month. And this translates into $338 in ad spend, Facebook ad spend per month. Now we can also calculate the cost per sale. We just divide the $338 per month by 100, uh, by, by two, sorry. And we get $169 per sale. So this would be basically example. Uh, this is something you can do for all kind of other marketing channels. It all depends on the questions you, you will answer yourself by creating your real estate marketing plan. And you can go then calculating with hard number, hard numbers. So I hope this first video was helpful, was helpful. And um, if you liked it, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell, please. Okay, thanks a lot. Bye bye.